Hi there, YouTube. Mark Vergeer here. Um, the concept of artificial intelligence and the creation of imagery and all sorts of media by AI is something I find very intriguing. I, uh, I posted a couple of videos on my uh, channel, which <laughs> may not be the most popular, but you know, I, uh, I liked, I liked uh, the experiment. So I did a video where I uh, wanted the AI to generate the, uh, the famous Japanese wave uh, image that yeah, a lot of people know uh, of that uh, wood carving and that pressed image. It's one of the oldest reproduced, mass reproduced uh, images uh, in human history. So I thought it quite fitting to actually uh, have that um, as one of the AI regenerations. And it's really funny because on a single input, text input, uh, various of these AI tools are able to create uh, quite some variation on the, th on the theme. And then what I also found very interesting was uh, The Screen by Edward uh, Munch because he himself actually uh, created a lot of variations on, uh, on the theme. He made two oil paintings, two pastel paintings, and even uh, a carved image. So I, I figured, why not let uh, the AI generate a similar image? And uh, what actually was created was something that is actually very similar if you, if you overlap it. And then, <laughs> Something that I, I, I quite like. I'm, I'm quite into Japan and, and uh, waterfalls and anime and, and that kind of stuff. So I figured, why not let the AI generate anime-inspired waterfall, uh, waterfalls and um, perhaps even introduce a pagode or something? And it did. Uh, so, and then... Um, I figured, let's see what the AI does, and that is this video. I mean, we, we know Baby Yoda. Baby Yoda, you know, the new uh, Star Trek, one of the new Star Trek uh, characters. And Baby Yoda, I, I, I figured, what would the AI make of uh, a, a Baby Yoda family photograph, you know? Just generate a Baby Yoda family photograph and just generate a, a ton of those and see what happens and, and, and well and it's it's funny because the the, the AI actually uh, generated quite an interesting looking full-on baby uh, Yoda with a Yoda family and I'm not sure how the AI works but it uses probably uses concepts or constructs and you see sometimes shifts appearing if you uh, let the images uh, generate repeatedly because suddenly some human uh, Caucasian skin tones were introduced and then uh, the babies, uh, the baby Yoda's got a different skin tone and then suddenly some human babies were introduced and then there was a shift to adults, humans in, in the pictures and then it ended with uh, granddads, a ton of granddads holding all sorts of babies, probably also baby Yoda, uh, family photos. And then it got a little disturbing with uh, severely deformed uh, baby Yodas that were, uh, and even a photograph of a granddad and a, and, a, and a baby that were human but had Yoda characteristics. And then uh, a really disturbing, very, very deformed uh, baby Yoda and even uh, the human granddad really looked eerie and uh, yeah I had to stop the AI because that was just like totally insane so yeah let's go check out the video and see it's it's the all the images in sequence uh, that were generated I left out a few because they're not all that interesting uh, but but I, I uh, actually put some texts in or over it over them just to note uh, what I just said you know happening uh, in the various uh, in the various image images and that's I'll, I'll promise that is going to be the last of the AI generated photos or clips that I uh, do
well, at least today. <laughs> we'll see. I mean, my channel is just about what I like. And um, yeah, if you have any hints, tips, suggestions on videos that you would like to see, I've been making uh, YouTube videos on and off, well, actually mostly on, for over a decade. And um, yeah, I wonder what you guys like. I know what I like. <laughs> Anyways, check out the video.